Welcome to your daily devotional, My Life Today, December, and Eternal Life. December 26th, Worship Together For as the new heavens and the new earth, which I will make, shall remain before me, says the Lord, so shall your seed and your name remain. And it shall come to pass that from one new moon to another, and from one Sabbath to another, shall all flesh come to worship before me, says the Lord. Isaiah 66, verses 22 and 23. In the beginning, the Father and the Son had rested upon the Sabbath after their work of creation. When the heavens and the earth were finished, and all the host of them, the Creator and all heavenly beings rejoiced in contemplation of the glorious scene. The morning stars sung together, and all the sons of God shouted for joy. When there shall be a restitution of all things, which God has spoken by the mouth of all his holy prophets since the world began, the creation Sabbath, the day on which Jesus lay at rest in Joseph's tomb, will still be a day of rest and rejoicing. Heaven and earth will unite in praise as from one Sabbath to another the nations of the saved shall bow in joyful worship to God and the Lamb. The nations of the saved will know no other law than the law of heaven. All will be a happy, united family, clothed with a garment of praise and thanksgiving. Over the scene, the morning stars will sing together and the sons of God will shout for joy. And it shall come come to pass that from one new moon to another, and from one Sabbath to another, shall all flesh come to worship before me, says the Lord. The glory of the Lord shall be revealed, and all flesh shall see it together. The Lord God will cause righteousness and praise to spring forth before all the nations. In that day shall the Lord of hosts be for a crown of glory and for a diadem of beauty unto the residue his people. So long as the heavens and the earth endure, the Sabbath will continue as a sign of the Creator's power. And when Eden shall bloom on earth again, God's holy rest day will be honored by all beneath the sun. An eternal life, December 26th.